Systemic racism is something that will come up commonly when you're discussing politics or social matters with people a lot today. The truth is it's a really churched up word, all right? It's literally impossible for a system, a country, or a demographic to be racist. Racism is an individual trait, period, bar none. So they'll say that because laws existed that allowed people to enact their racism without punishment, that that is systemic. No, it isn't. If it can be removed as easily as a stroke of a pen, such as a law or a federal government policy, it's not racism. That simple. Racism is the result of being a social animal. No bullshit. So, all social animals have a mechanism in their brain that identifies threats to the group so that they can bind together and attack that threat to the group, whatever that group identity is. Now, <clears throat> when you're talking about racial groups, those are an illusion. When it comes down to it, a human being is nothing but a high primate. And that's any human being. We're the most aggressive, most predatory primates on the planet. And we have the most developed sense of visual acuity and the most developed visual cortex of any land animal. This means a disproportionate amount of information and processing power is being used to determine what we see and how it affects us. So when our visual cortex sees someone that looks different from us, it wants to assign a difference other than skin deep. And in the case of race, that doesn't exist because race is a social construct. You wanna get rid of racism? Start by never voting for anybody that uses identity politics. If they're running on the idea that all men are abusers or sexist or are predatory, don't vote for that motherfucker. They're trying to tear men and women apart from each other. There's no good that can come from that. So if they're teaching you that every white person is born racist and they can only be racist and racism is a fucking natural result of their low melanin count, they're lying to you. It has nothing to do with what color your skin is and everything to do with how you process information and how you make decisions. If you think that skin color is a valid decision-making process, for judging human beings, you're a racist, period. So if you believe in critical race theory, you are by definition a racist. There's no escaping that. You can't say something stupid like you can't be racist to white people and expect that to carry any weight with somebody that's not stupid. All right? Racism has nothing to do with the size of the demographic it's being enacted against. Racism has nothing to do with who's got the most political power. And racism has everything to do with how you evaluate other human beings. The system isn't racist. It wasn't designed to uphold racism. And the only way you could think so is to completely disregard logic as part of your decision-making process.